Family members didn't have anything to say when they were seen leaving the courthouse. Evan Edwards and his son Joshua are accused of defrauding the federal government. They got $8.4 million from the Paycheck Protection Program and allegedly tried buying a multi-million dollar home by Disney World. According to a federal indictment, they claimed Aslan International Ministries had nearly 500 employees and fabricated documents showing millions of dollars in wages. But federal investigators say the real numbers were significantly lower or non-existent. Some local lawmakers who worked on helping legitimate businesses during the pandemic gave us their reaction. It's incredibly disappointing knowing that as we were helping thousands of Floridians access unemployment benefits, access PPP, IDLE, shuttered venue assistance, that you had individuals committing fraud. Uh, and not just committing fraud, but using that money for uh, purchases like million dollar homes. And I hope everyone, whether you took eight million or eight thousand dollars that you should have, you've stolen that from my children and your children. And I hope you go to jail for a very very long time. There have been many cases of COVID relief fraud still being prosecuted years later. A few months ago, a man pleaded guilty after using PPP funds to buy luxury cars and a mansion in Seminole County. This man was arrested after getting millions from PPP and buying a Lamborghini. And just last week, a state lawmaker resigned after he was accused of fraudulently obtaining a coronavirus loan. Evan and Joshua Edwards had already been ordered to, by the federal government to return that $8.4 million. They're both now facing several charges, including bank fraud. In downtown Orlando, Connor Hansen, Fox 35 News.